In the Osteo Myeloma Center, it's a center for clinical research. We started in late 2014. We do clinical research, phase one to phase four studies, academic studies, industry studies, and we also do retrospective studies. We serve a population of 2.5 million people living in the southeast region of Norway. Currently, we are enrolling patients into eight clinical studies in myeloma, from, uh, from small ring myeloma to plasma cell leukemia to newly diagnosed and also several relapse studies in myeloma. I think there's several big achievements. Uh, you have to consider that in 2014 there was not much studying going on on myeloma here at this center. And now we are the biggest Nordic myeloma center, making myeloma the biggest uh, disease uh, regarding how many patients are enrolled in studies in Norway. Myeloma is a, is a cancer, bone marrow cancer. It's the most common blood disease except for lymphoma. We thought that myeloma wasn't getting as much space as it needed for discussion, so we introduced tumor boards where we in the morning discuss every patient with myeloma and what to do with treatment, especially when they need new treatment. We work here at something called the KG Jepsen Center for B cell malignancies, and our task is to unravel what makes malignant B cells grow, how they develop, and what makes them happy. So at the KG Jepsen Center, we work with the pathogenesis and also treatment of B cell malignancies. And for the layman, B cell malignancy isn't really clear, but for uh, hematologists, it's the lymphomas and the leukemias and the myelomas that, this, that we work with to try to sort out what makes the cells grow and what treatment options we can have. Collaboration with clinicians is, is the heart of the matter. This collaboration allows us to receive myeloma patient samples with detailed history several times a week, which makes us able to both look at genetic and functional uh, responses linked to patient data and patient histories. The clinical trial unit has uh, the experience and infrastructure to perform phase one clinical trials. We're located at the heart of the hospital, right next to the CCU. The clinical trial unit is collaborating with a wide range of specialists and departments. So we're assisting the Oslo Myeloma Center with one phase one study that is running currently, and we have one more in planning. So it's super exciting to have the possibility to work with the research ward on this phase one study. Uh, we have over four months now been working with them and kind of using their resources and in their competency. And so in terms of conducting the study, treating the patients with a new regime is also very exciting. And we have now treated five patients. And it's been very exciting to be able to follow the patient from recruitment on and going through forward with the study, seeing the response of the medication that we've been given. And then also, if they exit the study, how we can follow up in the best way possible. So we continue the quality of care. The study that I'm participating in now is a phase one study, uh, trying out three different drugs in the treatment of the myeloma. Well, I'm in the sixth week of uh, my treatment now. Well, for me, the OMC is the link to the, the possibility of getting cutting edge uh, treatment, cutting edge uh, new drugs that become available. Our collaboration with Oslo Myeloma Center started up in 2015. Uh, we were first involved in a PET substudy in a multi-center trial where Oslo was one site. And later we have established a research and clinical collaboration. We have some upcoming collaborations, the COMPET study, and the COMPET study is involving four different hospitals in Scandinavia. As a PET facility, it is extremely important for us to be a part of a clinical and research environment, and the Oslo Myeloma Center is giving us this opportunity. We are doing altogether about uh, a little above 100 oral transplants per year and uh, approximately 120 autotransplants per year. Last year I think we did very close to 100 for myeloma. Uh, traditionally we haven't done uh, tandem transplantations uh, in myelomas, but we have started to do that during the last years uh, for high risk patients. We have a relapse study including transplant and we are also participating in the plasma cell leukemia study involving transplants. 
We are very interested in participating in the new development now with CAR T cells uh, and concerning myeloma. Uh, we have had uh, discussions and hope to be a part of that study in the near future. The Oslo University Hospital is a designated comprehensive cancer center. That means that we uh, meets the quality criteria at the highest level in Europe for both treatment of the, our patients but also in cancer research. Myeloma Center, I would say, takes the lead in Oslo. The way that they take trials to Oslo, the way they recruit uh, patients, the way they involve the whole region, it, uh, it's not an, only an example, it's an inspiration for other, uh, I would say, clinical researchers involved in other diseases.